Being charged in the plot to kidnap Governor Whitmer, these two are brothers, William and Michael Knoll from West Michigan, charged with providing material support for terrorist acts and firearm felonies. The two gentlemen that I know of that were arrested in my county or from my county, were they involved in that? You know, I don't know. They're, again, they're innocent until proven guilty. And we really, really should be careful of trying to try them in the media. Barry County Sheriff Dar Leaf took the stage with the Knowles at past rallies. A West Michigan TV station asked him Thursday if he regrets it after hearing the Knowles charges. It's just a charge, and they say a plot to kidnap. And you got to remember that are they trying to kidnap? Because a lot of people are angry with the governor, and uh, they want her arrested. So are they trying to arrest, or was it a kidnap attempt? Because you can still, in Michigan, if it's a felony, you can make a felony arrest. And I think it's MCL 764.4, something like that, 0.5, somewhere on there. And uh, it doesn't say if you're an elected office that you're exempt from that arrest. So you know, I have to look at it from that angle, and I'm, I'm hoping that's more what it is. In fact, they, these guys are innocent until proven guilty, so I'm not even sure if they had any part in it. The FBI complaint ascertains this plot was more than just a citizen's arrest. Documents show in an encrypted group chat, one of the alleged conspirators, Daniel Harris, said, have one person go to her house, knock on the door, and when she answers it, just cap her. Sheriff Leaf says he feels for the governor and doesn't condone violence. I reached out to him for comment today. He wasn't able to immediately respond. Give me a call back when you can. Scott Walchek, WIDM TV5.